What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Miran TV. My name is Miran Kirikosian. Today we have another amazing tutorial with Pop and John. We are focusing on popping drills. This is something you could do as a warm up or an exercise to really master your popping. Also keep in mind we have a full Pop and John tutorial playlist in the description box. So check that out as well. And if this is your first time on this channel and you have not subscribed, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell to get notified every single time we release a new video. Also leave your comments in the comment box. Let us know what other dance moves you would like to learn from Pop and John. Let's get started. What's up everybody? Pop and John here. Thanks again to Miran TV for having me. This week I'm gonna be breaking down some popping drills that you guys can do with me. Um, this is how I warm up. This is um, how I've really learned how to stay on time and focus on the pop is I go through these drills and exercises, okay? Um, as you can see, the logo in the back is flipped around because this video is mirrored, so you can follow along a lot easier, just like you're looking in the mirror. Okay, let's jump into it. All right, so a couple of things that I wanna talk about before we get into the drill is <clears throat> what we're doing is we're popping with our leg and we're popping with our arm. All right, so basically I'm, I'm going through this contraction of the muscles, okay? A couple of ways that I like to think about this is like you're driving a motorcycle. See how you kind of like tighten up your forearm and pop here. And with the leg, I am going back and I'm tightening up my muscles here in the leg, bam, all right? So basically the rhythm that we're gonna be playing with is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, that's kind of like a continuous popping rhythm. We're popping on each um, count. Um, we're doing two, two pops per position. So it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're gonna change positions and you guys are gonna follow along. All right guys, to break the arms down a little bit, um, basically we are thinking about doing a move and tightening everything up to stop that move from going too far, okay? So it's like I wanna do this, like I'm on a motorcycle, vroom, but my forearms tighten up and keep it from going too far, okay? So eventually you'll get to where your muscles just like have that muscle memory to where it's just like doing this pop and not really thinking about the motion that you're trying to stop. But to, to kinda like, cheat your, your muscles into understanding what you want it to do is think about doing a motion and tighten everything up to stop it from happening. Okay, so it's like I wanna do this with my wrist and I tighten everything up to keep it from going too far. Okay, and that's where you start to get this like, kind of like electric pop, boom, boom, boom. All right, it's just like I wanna do like a karate chop, but I stop it. I stop it from going too far. So see how my muscles tighten up and it stops my hand from going any farther? Boom, boom. So all of these uh, basic positions are almost like I wanna go farther, but I tighten everything up to stop it from going farther, okay? That's one way you can really get this muscle memory like burnt into your body. Um, another like key is I'm always um, firing my forearms, okay? My forearms are always popping, okay? Any position I'm in, my forearms are always going, all right? Um, the different positions that we're gonna be hitting, uh, different muscles are gonna start to get in the mix. Like for example, in this position, I'm doing forearms and biceps, bam. Okay, you can see my bicep moving there, all right? And then if like I'm out here, we're gonna be doing more tricep, but always I'm doing forearm. Okay, and basically I'm flexing that muscle and I'm going back to relaxed. Flex, relax, flex, relax, flex, relax. And we're really trying to be on, on time with the music. We're trying to be on beat 
And the rhythm that we're going to be doing is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the time in between, I'm going back to relaxed. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. See, there's this moment where I'm, I'm relaxed in between. Let me break down the legs a little bit. What I'm doing with my legs is I'm shifting my weight to the leg that I'm going to pop with. Okay, so if we're going to do this pattern, I'm going to pop with my arm on this side and my leg on this side. Okay, so I shift my weight to that side and what I'm doing is I'm taking my knee from, from bent to all the way back. Okay, I'm not really focused on the joint, I'm more focused on the muscle. Okay, I'm really focused on my quads here. I'm going bam and I'm flexing my leg right here. Okay, I'm really flexing my leg, boom, right here. But I'm shifting my weight to the side that that pop is happening on. Okay, so I'm going one, two. See how arm and leg both happen at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm going to be going one, two, three, four. All right. So see how I'm shifting side here. My weight's on this side. I'm popping with this leg, and then I'm shifting to the other side, and I'm popping with this leg. All right. I'm really focused on tightening up my leg muscles here. Boom. All right. So see how that's flexed here. So I'm going one, two, shifting to the other side, three, four. Okay. And another really good key is even if I'm just popping on this side, I make it kind of a rule for myself to pop with everything that I can at that time. So like I'm popping with this arm and this leg, but at the same time I'm popping with this arm just to kind of make it a full body thing. So I'm going, watch this arm for a second. Mm. Bah. See how it pops down here by itself? So if I'm on this side, I'm going to be popping with this arm down here. Okay? I know that's kind of a lot, like at the same time, we're kind of like doing this. But um, if you kind of like start to play with the rhythms and the techniques, sometimes this stuff just happens automatically and you don't have to think too much about it. All right? And if it doesn't happen automatically, it just means we need to practice. That's it. Practice is the key and uh, it takes time. This is a really good drill to kind of like fake it till you make it. You know, you kind of like cheat your body into getting this muscle memory down. All right, so let's jump into it. Here we go, guys. Follow along. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One.
is a popping drill, so make sure that you treat it kind of like an exercise, like a warm-up. Really focus on all the techniques that we talked about. Um, it takes time, and uh, don't try not to rush yourself. Try not to like try to do too much. It, it's okay to kind of like keep it basic for a while and just focus on those positions and being on beat. Um, thank you guys for watching, and uh, hope to see you guys here next time. All right, peace. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you really want to master your popping, make sure to do this drill every single day until you feel really, really strong about your popping. Also keep in mind we have a full Poppin' John playlist in the description box. Make sure to check that out along with all of his social media links, so don't forget to follow. If this is your first time on our channel and you have not subscribed, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell to get notified on all the releases. Also leave your comments in the comment box. Let us know what other tutorials you would like to see by Poppin' John. I'll see you guys on the next one.